Hey folks, I'm Kyle Lamb with Viking Tactics. We wanted to show you a new way to carry your ballistic bear spray if you're out there in the woods. Rather than having uh, a holster on your hip that sometimes interferes with your rucksack or your backpack, we decided to make one that goes on your chest. Now this looks very similar to some of those out on the market, but we've made a few changes to make this uh, something you really ought to check out. First of all, uh, ballistic nylon, super heavy duty. We've added all metal buckles and the acetyl buckles or plastic buckles that are on this rig are all replaceable. So if you're up there in Alaska, it's really cold, you step on your buckle and you break it, you can simply pop these buckles off and we'll have those sold separately as replacement buckles on our website. We made two different versions of this. One is the revolver version. This is a 460 Smith & Wesson. This is made to actually uh, accommodate that as well as smaller revolvers. So if you have your 44 Magnum, Scandium, whatever it might be, uh, even single actions, they'll fit in this rig. The other version that we made is for the large frame autos. I've got a uh, 10 millimeter Glock shown here. Slips into the holster, cinch it down, and you're good to go. What we've done on the back is we've also added some belt loops. So if you do want to carry this on your belt or run a rucksack buckle from the side of your pack through there to hold this on the side of your pack, you can also do that. We've also added a couple additional lashing points, so if you want to lash this down on the side of a four-wheeler, uh, ATV, or even on the side of your snow machine, if that's how you're going to run and carry this, uh, carry this pistol. That'll also work out well if you want to put it on the side of your pack. On the back, we have the, uh, the shoulder strap, which is a little bit wider for comfort there. If you're going to carry this for a long time, it won't dig into your shoulder. And then we've added a little bit of elastic so that when you're bending over doing things, you won't have an issue there as well. Lastly, we've added a G-hook on the side of the holster here so it'll hold down the bottom of the holster. It's simply a G-hook that can either be hooked just through your belt loop if you wanted to do that. You can just hook that onto a belt loop. Of course, I don't have it tight enough for this one right now. I normally like to run it around my belt, back up on itself, and then hook it. And that way it keeps the bottom of the holster from flopping around. You really don't need that with these bigger guns, but if you're going to be around camp working and you want to make sure you have your pistol on you at all times, that's the way to hook it up. All right, that's the big rig for your ballistic bear spray available from vikingtactics.com.